Hello, and welcome to JXJ Aviation. In this video we will be looking at, what is the approach phase? The types of approaches? And why is it important for a safe landing? Why approach phase? Let's consider an aircraft, flying from point A, to point B. In a normal flight, the aircraft will climb to its cruise altitude, after takeoff. From this altitude, the aircraft must descend towards the runway, at point B. To ensure a safe and smooth landing on the runway, the aircraft must be aligned with the center line of the runway, and it has to descend at the correct glide path. This is done by following the correct approach path, in the approach phase. What is the approach phase? The approach phase of an aircraft starts when an aircraft descends below 5,000 feet. Here, the aircraft will align and descend gradually towards the runway. The approach phase ends when the aircraft reaches the runway threshold. There are different types of approaches. Precision approach. Non-precision approach. And visual approach. What is a precision approach? A precision approach provides both horizontal and vertical guidance to the aircraft towards the runway in use. A precision approach can be done with an instrument landing system, or computer-generated navigation data, or precision approach radar. A precision approach will include a decision height or decision altitude. At this height, the flight crew will decide to continue or discontinue the approach. What is non-precision approach? A non-precision approach only provides horizontal guidance. A continuous descent final approach, or CDFA technique, is used to descend continuously, at a particular angle, towards the runway, after the final approach point. The final approach point will be located at a particular distance from the runway. A non-precision approach will include a minimum decision height, or minimum decision altitude. The aircraft can descend below this altitude only after visual confirmation of the runway is achieved. If visual confirmation is not achieved until a particular point or distance, a go-around must be performed. What is visual approach? A visual approach is an approach which is done using visual references. The references that can be used for approach guidance are the runway, runway lights, glide slope indicator lights, or the terrain. This approach is only permitted if the weather conditions are good and there is good visibility. Normally precision approaches are preferred because it provides both lateral and vertical guidance to the aircraft. These approaches require a ground-based system to provide the signals required for the approach. In places where ground-based equipment is not available or cannot be installed, a non-precision approach or a visual approach can be used. In non-precision approach, approach charts are used to maintain the correct heading and descent angle. A visual approach can be performed only if there is good weather, good visibility, and less traffic. Thank you for watching. If you like the video, please subscribe, and you can continue watching some of my other videos as well.